How many more losses do the Cowboys need to have before you throw out your NFC Championship prediction? I did predict the Cowboys would at least make it to the NFC Championship game for the first time since 1995, 27 years ago. Hey, I love my prediction through three quarters Sunday at Lambeau when my Cowboys were in com complete control 28 to 14. But as I said before that game, that down the stretch, I could just see it coming. Dak Prescott would have to match magic with Aaron Bleep and Rodgers. In fact, I did the whole top of last week's podcast about how that vampire number 12 has sucked the life out of us in so many big games, so many late clutch moments. So what happened right on cue, Aaron Rodgers scored 17 in the fourth quarter in overtime while Dak Prescott had the ball four times in the fourth quarter in overtime and scored zero goose egg, nada. Now here we go again. Dak's team opened as a two-point favorite at 8-1 Minnesota this coming Sunday. <laughs> My backup quarterbacks, Andy Dalton and <clears throat> Cooper Rush, have beaten Kirk Cousins at Minnesota each of the last two years. Dak is 4-1 lifetime against Kirk Cousins, who is now ranked 22nd in the NFL in QBR. So now back to Vic's question. The Cowboys should win at Minnesota. They should turn right around, beat the Giants at Jerry World on Thanksgiving. I mean, Cooper Rush beat the Giants at the Giants on Monday Night Football earlier this season. But I will admit, if the Giants do lose these next two, I'm pretty sure my prediction is kaput. I, I guess they could still pick themselves right up off the mat. <laughs> Maybe they could regroup and regather over a 10-day mini-buy. I, I guess they could win their final six to get to 12 and five, but <laughs> you know and I know, three losses in a row at this point in the season would be devastating for my team and especially for my quarterback. Dak Prescott is to me at a career crossroads this Sunday and then Thursday. If he doesn't play well enough to win these games, these two games, I'm sorry, it's going to be time for Jerry Jones to seriously start thinking about who the next Dallas Cowboy quarterback will be. I hope you enjoyed that video. You ready for more? Make sure you click that subscribe button for all the exclusive content from The Skip Bayless Show. And don't forget to check out the full episode of the show wherever you get your podcasts by clicking the link in the description.